Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So today we're playing with another teen mod. Two teen mods in one week. Sims 4 teenagers are getting a lot of attention from me this week it seems. So today we're going to be playing with a mod by A Deep Indigo. I've just noticed a pop-up already. Before, before I read that I'm just going to quickly show you the mod. It's called the Dynamic Teen Life mod. It says here five days ago, I am recording this in advance because by the time this video goes up, hopefully, if all goes well, I'll be in London. So it might be available for public release by the time this comes out. It comes out on September 10th, but as of today, the day I'm recording this, it's still in early access. First impressions, it looks like it includes quite a lot. You've got new journal entries, looks like there's been some added functionality, added gameplay for mental health. New after school activities as well. I think there are seven brand new ones. There's also a popularity system, which I caught sight of in my game just before heading over to this page. A romantic life, social groups, teen activities. It looks like there's loads added in this mod. So I don't know if we'll be able to cover everything, but we'll, we'll do a video on the first impressions and see what we can explore today. You might even recognise this family. These are the teens we used to complete the Drama Llama aspiration. Pretty sure it was Alice that we played with that time. So we're here again with these two. And I see she's already been assigned the trait of not popular or unpopular. And she's also been assigned a social group, Rebel Rousers. I'm just going to check those notifications. New popularity status. Popularity during the high school years equates to social status. Being popular can open up both admiration, jealousy, emulation and annoyance from peers, whilst opening up doors for more social opportunities and perks. So Chester is indifferent to being popular, and he's been assigned the social group of womp jocks, and Alice cares about being popular. So all of that stuff is like assigned to your sims as soon as you start playing with them. I'm not sure if it's based on their aspiration or their traits, or if it's just randomly assigned. I think I read that it's based on like how many sims your sim knows, how many followers they have on Social Bunny and all of that. Channeling group verve and enthusiasm gives Alice an awesome feeling. Okay, so she has a mood buff from being assigned to a social group. He doesn't. I guess probably because he doesn't really care about popularity. Probably doesn't help actually that I use this sim for the Drama Llama aspiration because I just realised she's got a lot of enemies. I wonder if I click on Chester's profile if it will show me what social group he's in. No, I can't see which social group he's in without playing as him. Can I ask him though? Ask how to be popular. Yeah, yeah. If you have to ask, you'll never know. <laughs> Alright, bitch. Discuss why womp jocks are the best. Complain about rival social group. That's gonna piss her right off because she's not in the womp jocks. We are clearly the best. We are amazing athletes. We host the best parties and everyone loves us when we win. There's nothing to not love about being us. It might just be coincidence, but Chester can't shake the feeling that others are just constantly judging him. Oh great, he's developed a fear of judgment. Guys, come on, you're, you're siblings, be nice. Apologise. I don't want you to fight. We're supposed to be friends. I'm going to get them to join some of the new after school activities. Alice, I think, is currently a cheerleader, but we're also gonna quit cheerleading and join another after school activity. So they can become an adventure club member Arts and Crafts Club member, although it looks like some of these, to join a team, Teen Sims must first try out and be invited to join. Oh, you gotta prove you're good enough. Some of them you can just join straight off the bat, like the swim team and the adventure club member. I wonder how I send them to tryouts then. Oh, here we go, okay. So it's not really the right time, but at least I know how to now. I just have to check on the phone and then we can go to tryouts. So we'll do tryouts tomorrow. Also, I'm glad that you are playing with your diary there, Alice, because that was something else that I wanted to look at. So you also get some new diary entries as well. 
So lots of new options. Relive memories, sort out feelings from today, complain about teachers and school, complain about everyone and everything. That's what we'll do. We'll complain about everyone and everything. Write mean things about someone. Oh, we have to do that. We'll make our own little burn book. Write nice things about friends and family. Write a negative summary of the day. <laughs> Write about wants and fears. Yes, there's a lot more, a lot more option when it comes to writing things in your journal. You practice in your speech there, Chester. Practice in your pickup lines. Yeah. Flirting. Yeah. Oh, that was another thing. I wanted as well to have a look at like the mental health side of things. Which I'm guessing would what be under social? Attend teen support group. Is it too late to attend a teen support group 1am? Oh, I guess not. I think he's just going. I thought maybe there would be some kind of menu for me to choose what he's getting support for. Also, love that she has a happy mood buff from writing shit about people. Another day, another entry. We love writing mean things, don't we, Alice? I've just noticed Chester's got a mood buff. <laughs> Won't bring me down from facial hair mockery. So I guess Alice took it upon herself to take the piss out of his beard. I always prefer playing as assholes. It just comes natural to me, I don't know why. Right, Alice, you better go get some sleep. It doesn't feel like a very teenage, like, bedtime attire. <laughs> you kind of look like you should be holding a cigar. Like a retired, wealthy old man is what you look like right now. Oh, you're going to go write in your diary again? What are you doing? Write mean things about someone. <laughs> Ah, uh, I love this sim. She's brilliant. I want, did I give her a mean trait? Is that why she's... Yeah, okay, okay. That makes sense. So hopefully while we're at school today, we'll meet someone else who's in our clique. Or click. Is it clique or is it click? Either way, some rebel rousers we're going to find. Rebel rousers are a social group. They guess. They don't really care. They get together, or don't get together, and do what they want. Who cares? What are you going to do about it? I like that description. What's the description for his one? Womp jocks. Womp jocks are a social group comprised of athletes. We accept those who are active, health conscious, care about fitness, and wear sports uniforms. We work hard, and we play hard. Go womp womps! I prefer the other group, to be honest, the group that doesn't really give a shit. That would probably be the group I would be in. Inconsiderate, unbothered by anything, only ever really gives about 10%. Yeah, that's probably the shelf that I would fit on. Uh, let's go. I will go with... Well, you know what? I'll go with both. And then that way, if I want to switch to Chester for whatever reason, I can. I play by my own rules. So I'm guessing with my click, um, I'll... At times when I'm just going about my business, I'm guessing someone will like call me and invite me to like a click hangout. Oh, I was going to talk to her, but I can't. We're enemies. What about him? Okay, I'm not enemies with this sim. Hard to find someone that doesn't hate me. So let's go and ask him about his day. Oh, I can spread rumor about a classmate. Oh, he's on the womp jocks. Who should I spread a rumor about? Well, I already hate Savannah Price. So let's spread a nasty rumor about her. And then also I'm going to gossip about a classmate. Going to take my spoon made of shit and stir the pot. I heard Savannah cheated on last week's test. <laughs> That's right. High school's number one shit stirrer right here. And I'm proud to be it. Someone's got to. Right, so after school today, I'm going to go to tryouts. Because I would quite like for Alice to join the drama club. I feel like she would be really good at acting because she's a proper good liar. So she could probably do wonders on stage. Noah is my enemy rival, or he was when I was doing the cheerleading job. He's in the artist collective, okay? Can I find anyone who is in the same, same little clique as me? I want to find common ground with someone. <gasps> this sim is currently in the same social group. Okay, okay. I'm going to go introduce myself then. Finally, I have found someone else who is a part of the We Don't Give a Shit Club. Well, I have to go to class now. You can still introduce yourself. You don't have to be such a square about it. You don't have to run to class. There is one thing 
that I won't be able to show you, well, one thing. I think we'll probably just about scratch the surface of this mod because there's so much in it. But there is one thing I definitely know I probably won't be able to show you. Why do you look so concerned? What's your problem? The attitude of it. Yeah, is uh, so I, there's like a, a dating feature. And part of that is you have to ask your parents permission to go dating. But she can't do that because she doesn't have any parents. She's an orphan kid, her and her brother, so we won't be able to look at that today. Maybe I'll just get a picture of her looking pissed off for the thumbnail. Why are you so angry? Oh, obviously because she's tense. She's tense because she's going through puberty and she's underprepared from forgetting to do her homework. Well, you don't have to sit there with the face on. I think she's just going to have a little nap. I think there are some new interactions depending on your popularity as well. I wonder if there's a way for me to like cheat. Just cheat her popularity. Just to try something. Oh, dynamic teen life cheats. Okay. Right, I'm going to increase her popularity status. Alice is now popular. Other Sims will know this about her and may or may not affect how others view her, respond to invitations, conversations or requests. Yeah, that's right. Respect me. So does that mean I can tease people now for not being popular? Complain about rival social group. Let's just find some common ground there. I can boast about my popularity. Too right, I will. Too right. But the main thing I'm interested in is the put-downs. Can I be mean to someone? Ha! Huh. Tease about being unpopular. There we go. Brag about how popular we are and then tease her for not being as popular. If you have to ask, you'll never know. I didn't ask you how to be popular, I already know. I already cracked that code. Cheating. Brush with popularity. Oh wait, is that sim also popular? Alice can't believe a popular sim just spoke to them, how cool. Oh shit, I pissed, oh, I pissed off the wrong person there. Turns out she's actually more popular than me. So, I'm gonna have to bear that in mind. I, I need to just try and pick on the weak ones, really. What about Molly Prescott? Is there just a real simple way I can find out just from clicking on someone how popular they are? She's in the nerd brains. Of course she fucking is. Okay, there we go. Tease about being unpopular. What are you going to do? Tell your mum on me. How's little Chester getting on? All right, school's out. Let's try out for drama club. I want to be an actress. She's very confident, which is the perfect mood for a drama club tryout. Okay, so she's gone to a rabbit hole, and I'm thinking, Chester, let's send you home, and then we'll check out some of the teenage activities, maybe. Congrats, Alice, you're a... Oh, it's because she's gone home. But it looked to me like we got on the drama club team. Congrats, Alice. Your audition went very well. If you'd like, you're invited to join the club by signing up. Yes, I would like to sign up. We're going to quit cheerleading and we're going to go ahead and join the drama club. And then Chester, we're going to send you on a couple activities. There we go. Oh, wait, no, that was the wrong drama club. Oh, I'm such a stupid bitch. Right, let's... Let's try this again. I'm going to have to audition again now, aren't I? Because I auditioned for the fucking drama club. Performance art. Yes, that's what I want. Okay. So we'll have our first day at performance art tomorrow. Anyway, Chester, perhaps we'll pop out for a little bit. Teen activities. Just Chester. This mod kind of behaves pretty similarly to the one I looked at um, earlier this week, doesn't it? She's got some different types of events. College fair, date, debate club, experiment with friends, group date, hang out at the mall. I think we're going to go experiment with friends. You don't have to worry about getting caught because you're an orphan, so no worries there. Okay, Alice, well done. Your tryout was successful. Maybe if you could take a break from taking selfies, we will join the correct after school activity. I mean, I blame myself, but it's just as much your fault as well, you dipshit. We're both accountable in this. Uh, there we go. Performance art club. So, let's practice singing. Alice is a budding performance artist. Those in the club are not quite convinced. But with time and increasing performance skill, Alice will show them. Working on skilling up in a musical instrument, singing or acting, as well as brushing up on some dance moves, can go a long way towards proving yourself. 
Oh god, she sounds so bad. In hindsight, Alice, maybe this was a mistake. It's even worse in super speed. Sounds like something you'd hear in your nightmares. Oh, you're back! How'd you get on, Chester? Experimenting excitement. Chester knows that it isn't for everyone, but he feels good. Can't wait to try some other things. Uh, why don't we send you out on another teen activity? We'll do a couple. What else could be a good one? Maybe the school newspaper. Oh, Chester is back from his teen activity. That must have been from when he went experimenting. I am curious about the mental health stuff as well. Because I sent Chester to, like, a support group. But apparently you can also talk about feelings, call a counsellor, call a hotline. Yeah, you can attend a teen support group. But maybe you have to be, like, in a certain state before you can do that? I don't know. Oh, I think Chester got himself some skills in photography. Draft, draft. Oh no, Chester was sure autosave was on when writing their latest draft. But it seems they were mistaken. What to do now? Oh, Chester, how stressful. Well, you know what? I think I'm going to end this video here. If you like the look of this mod, I will link it in the video description. As I say, a lot of Adeep in Dingo's mods are really beefed out. There's quite a lot of gameplay to be had. And in this video, I doubt we've even seen the half of it. But I think I'm going to keep this mod installed. This has been pretty fun. I have really like the clicks. I think the clicks and the popularity system are probably my favourite features. And I, you know, anything that introduces kids being mean to each other is always going to go down well with me. So I appreciate being able to tease each other about being unpopular. So yeah, on that note, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.